a world power in weightlifting with 36 Olympic medals. But the Bulgarian national team is now struggling under the weight of too many doping scandals. And despite the hard training, these athletes won't be competing at the Olympics in Brazil this summer. They've all been banned. It's all ended. I didn't know what to think, it just ended. We trained for competitions for years, and at some point it all crumbled. Minchiev is one of 11 athletes who tested positive for the steroid stenazolol in March 2015. They were banned for 9 or 18 months, depending on whether it was their first or second offence, after arguing a herbal supplement they were taking was tainted. The national coach blames the country's weightlifting federation for neglecting the sport and not making sure the pills were tested. Everyone knows the truth, that this pill was taken without knowing that it was tainted. Anyway, we keep looking ahead and we'll fight. At 15 years old, Nadeshda May and Gun was the youngest team member to be banned. Back in competition, she's now battling to regain her confidence. I managed to fight through it somehow. There's such hard times, yes, in every sport, like in life. Will! The ban has seen all state funding cut, hitting clubs up and down the country. Trainers argue hard work is not enough with supplements essential to aid recovery. Our biggest pain is the lack of money. Things can't work out based on enthusiasm, spirit and tradition only. As well as vitamins, the athletes need equipment and money to travel to competitions. With the sport weighed down by scandals, these youngsters will need not just physical strength, but plenty of mental strength too.